Welcome and welcome back to Scorpio Tiger Zero. I'm Scorpio Tiger. I need to start running up the stairs and pushing that button. I know y'all like, where she been? Where you been? I got a whole bunch of cancers in my family. Yeah, and it, it, it's been lit. Okay, but I'm back. Don't worry about it. Let's do your weekly. This is the weekly reading. It's a general reading, so take what resonates. Leave the rest. And if love shows up, reverse rolls as needed. Now, you guys know that um, I started y'all reading twice. <laughs> the first time I started y'all reading, I got on camera and started saying Libra. The whole reading came out Libra. I don't know what that was about. Then I started it again, and then something came up. I had to run down there. So, here we go again. Let's get into you guys reading, though. I hope everyone enjoyed their holidays and had a wonderful time with the family and stuff, too, okay? Good stuff. Your raw energy is the strength, Leo. Okay? Let's get into this. Let's get some energies for the Aquarius collective. The Aquarius collective. What's going on with the Aquarius? We got the Wheel of Fortune. What else we got going on with the Aquarius collective? What other energies we got for the Aquarius collective? Okay, King of Cups in uh, reverse. Okay. All right. Justice, that Libra energy. All right. We got the Ace of Cups and the Six of Swords. Okay. Okay. I'm going to have to look up that Wheel of Fortune sitting next to that King of Cups in reverse. At the bottom of the deck, we got the Seven of Wands. Okay. There's going to be either some communication or you're going to be successful in defeating your enemies, okay? It looks like something's going to throw you off balance or you've been off balance for a while now. And with this justice sitting here, this Libra energy, it's like you're going to get your balance. You're going to get your justice. And I'm hearing like uh, um, in the form of money, like you're going to get blessed with some money or something, Aquarius. And the, uh, the, the Ace of Cups. All the money is overflowing, the love overflowing, and then you're going to be able to move to karma waters. Your life is going to settle, settle down. Okay, that's what I'm seeing. Let's clarify. Will of Fortune. Why is this here for the Aquarius Collective? Why is this here for the Aquarius Collective? The Will of Fortune. This card, I believe, of success, of the most high, divine timing. Why is the Will of Fortune here? Okay, the nine of swords, and that's what I thought. I'm, I'm gonna clarify it though, but that's what I was thinking it was that you had been in um, a stress. You've been under a lot of stress here lately. That's what I was thinking. Okay, Will of Fortune could be soulmates. It's also abundance and fortune, and and something or someone coming towards you is positive. Good luck, success, luck, chance, happiness, destiny, change, upheaval. It's karma, so be nice. Okay? Cycles of life, all right? Universe is working in your favor. Focus on what it is you truly want. And this is all the will of fortune, okay? And love relationships is relationship changes. Single, get out and mingle, okay? But to me, it seems like universe is working, of course. This is about time. To get you out of this slump that you've been in. Definitely. Mm-hmm. Okay. King of Cups. Why is this in reverse? Why is the King of Cups in reverse? For the Aquarius Collective. This energy in this reading. Why is the King of Cups in reverse? Okay. Why is that King of Cups in reverse? Okay, we got the empress and the lovers. Um, it might, it must have been some relationship changes. Okay, because this relationship has you off kilter. Okay, this is somebody that's imbalanced, and this right here is all about love. Okay, with that empress, that Virgo energy. Okay, 
So I guess it is talking about relationship changes. Okay. It's got you stressed out. You're not sleeping too good, Aquarius. Yeah, you're heartbroken. Trying to figure out what to do. Justice. Why is this here? This Libra energy. Why is justice here? Thank you. Queen of Pentacles and the Page of Pentacles. Okay. Yeah, you're focused on your money. You're gaining the knowledge and, and you're focused on your coins. That's going to be your justice. That's where it's going to come from. Okay. Good stuff. Or a Queen of Pentacles may be making you an offer. Okay. That could be a male or female. It's just somebody who, who takes care of home and um, that's knowledgeable and someone who's paying attention to their money. Okay. It could be a guy. All right. Ace of Cups. Why is this here? Yeah, but I think it's, it's you, of course. I think you're just paying attention to your business and your money. <coughs> oh, excuse me. <coughs> excuse me. I think you're just paying attention to your money. That's what I think that is. And that's going to bring you justice. Ace of Cups. Why is the Ace of Cups here? Excuse me. Why is the Ace of Cups here? I don't know what's up with my throat. <coughs> oh my goodness gracious. <coughs> Who's that about? I'm sorry, excuse me. Ace of Cups. Why is this here? <clears throat> What's going on with my throat chakra? Oh, goodness gracious. Yeah, Ace of Cups. I ain't even saying nothing yet. <laughs> yeah, but the thing is, somebody could be talking about me right now. Mm, yeah. Ace of Cups. Why is this here? Yeah. Somebody could be talking about me. Got me. Over here, <clears throat> throat tickling. Try to drink the water. Felt like I was about to drown. Yeah, just from somebody talking about you. All right, Ace of Cups. Mmm. Oh wow. Ace of Cups is is a is a card of abundance, and the magician just came out in reverse. So you worried about the, your abundance? Having self doubt about the happiness ever coming back to, coming back to you? That's what that is. <coughs> Excuse me. You, you're worried about. You, you're not sure if you're ever going to have love again. That's what it looks like. It also says uh, manipulated by others. Okay. So your abundance may have, have gotten you manipulated by other people. Okay. Let's get another card for the Ace of Cups. Further clarify, please. You're being told that you need to be clear about what it is that you want. Whether in prayer or with the people that you're dealing with. You need to be very clear and direct or cut these people off. That you know are manipulating you. Okay? Or just stop worrying about your abundance because the universe has you. Okay? Yeah. Don't worry about it. Mm -hmm. You're going to defeat your enemies. When you're closer to your wish fulfillment than you think. Six of Swords. Why is this here for the Aquarius Collective? Okay. <clears throat> yeah. Look. You're about to move to your happiness. 
It might not seem like it, but it's about to go down. Okay. It's about to go down in the deal. <laughs> it go down in the deal. <laughs> I won't say what's for real, but you're going to be fine. Let's get, let's get you some, uh, some advice. Yeah. So this relationship breaking up is really throwing you off kilter. Focusing on your money, um, your work, your money, that's what's going to uh, help you get out of that slump. Okay? Anything for the Aquarius Collective. <clears throat> what we got here? Don't leave me. Not ready to part ways. So you trying to leave them or you or you don't want them to leave you. What's going on with y'all, Aquarius, huh? <clears throat> Anything else? Alright. Oh. Insecure. That's what it is. That's what that whole right there with the magician and the ace of cups is talking about you being insecure, huh? Don't do that. Mm -hmm. If you think insecure thoughts, it's, it's going to tear you down. You're not going to operate at your highest self, you know? If you're struggling with um, limiting thoughts and feelings, you're going to mess up your blessings doing that. When a negative thought comes in, try to, three, try to think three positive thoughts. <clears throat> For real. Oh, I'm sorry. We got to go to the world because you're heartbroken. Any advice for the Aquarius Collector? Any advice for the Aquarius Collector? Any advice for the Aquarius Collector? No? Okay, you ain't ready. And that's alright. Aquarius Collector, any advice? <clears throat> Any advice for the Aquarius Collective? Okay. Yeah, see, you worthy. I can't make these cards up. You worthy. You worthy of love. You worthy of that house you want. You worthy of that vacation you want to take. You worthy of your job. You are worthy, Aquarius. And don't think no otherwise. Radical rebirth. Yeah, you're about to go through a transformation. Every time after some pain, people go through transformations. How do you think I found Tarot? Well, I'm sorry. Tarot found me. Radical rebirth. Okay. Yeah, you're about to go through a change and don't fight it. All right? You guys, thank you so much for hanging in there with me. All right? I hope you guys have a wonderful week. Good luck with this Aquarius. And I'll see you guys soon. Take care.